<laughs> God damn, you make an impression, boy. Didn't mean no offense by that. Listen, it's not setting well with Santini that people think they don't have to pay for protection. And it sounds like no one trusts him to deliver on gun deals like usual. Imagine that's got him pretty pissed off. <laughs> got him, Enzo, and Marcano looking weak. Going over to the train yard. Santini's there now trying to figure out what the hell he's gonna do. Been fun, Connie. Keep it tucked up out there. <laughs> I count my blessings. I still have most of my teeth. I can still see pretty good. <laughs> And, uh... Boy, Mr. Santini got here not too long ago. He pissed? Is he pissed? Goddamn right he's pissed. Christ, do you know how much money he makes off of those trains? Took a baseball bat to Little Eddie. Fuck. Little Eddie's head split like a goddamn watermelon. We fucked this up. He's coming after us next. So let me know if you see something. Just don't let nothing happen to me. I'll figure out what that was. Oh, 
the sweat yet? He's here! Yeah, over here! Hey, I got that cocksucker! I boxed you! Back me up, boys! Get that stupid son of a bitch! Places to hide, partner. Oh, what in my?
you out of your mind? You know, I really thought I could make this work. Guess you were wrong. I need some of your boys in Barclay Mills. Yeah, okay. But if you're asking me to commit the lives of my men here, then I expect you to commit to me. And remember this road was setting out on in the here and now. Anyone who thinks Sammy Robinson was the Mardi Gras mastermind is a moron. And just because he was involved doesn't mean it was his idea. And none of the evidence ever added up. The money wasn't recovered, and Sammy didn't shoot himself in the back of the head and then burn down his own bar. The only reason people believe Sammy was behind it was his skin color. Requesting a supply run to Barclay Mills. Going at you. Hang tight. Which will probably be exactly what happens. Definitely. See anything you need? Show me what you got.
your business is done, you know how to find me. You're... not what I expected. This was a mistake. I don't want any trouble. Someone told me you work at the dump, that you might have information for me. Now, your name's Maria, right? Mm-hmm. Maria Bava. I've only been at the dump a couple of months. Accounts receivable. I know. Glamorous. Paul Simmons runs the place. Everybody calls him Puppy, though. You've got to stop him. Stop him from doing what? Dumping waste in the bay, extorting drivers from other garbage companies, but that's... That's not the worst thing they're doing, is it? Mister, they're killing people. Puppy... <sighs> Mr. Simmons doesn't know how to keep his boys down on the phone, but he was arguing with one of the cleaners, kept saying how they'd been paid to get rid of somebody. You know when these cleaners will be around? No, but some of the other guys who work for the dump might. I'll chase down information on these cleaners, along with the rest of the dump's business. It's gonna be all right, Maria. You did the right thing. Well, Mr. Simmons' people might know more about the illegal dumping and the bodies. had to go this way. What kind of bullshit was that?